chicken or rooster? Who's going to be and run Big Ben? Who's going to run Big Ben? Who puts the sock underneath? Underneath what? Is it over or under? Over the fireplace. What's it going to be? Who runs the clock? Who puts up the sock? Is it all about Santa's claws? I think it's all about the chicken. The chicken and the rooster. Are you scared of me, big cock? I want to know about your red head. Where is the red head? Is she in Russia? Why the chickens come out with their chests sticking out like this and no nipples? They have to hit chest on chest, no nipples. Who's got the biggest breast? You know what I like about the, the small breast? If you have a small pointed breast when it's young, you're divided to the left and divided to the right. But when you get older and you get a big chest, you hit chest on chest. You know what I'm saying? The little chest, you're pushed over, right? And then the big chest. And cock a doodle doo. Any cock a doo for the fight. The ego. The ego, the egg, the ego, the waffle, the ego, the waffle like ego, ego. Is in the mind the broken up nine lives of the cat lives in the life of the chicken. Are you chicken or are you rooster? Hit me with your breast, my friend. It's a big breast fight out there when the cocks fight. That's what I'm I'm just listening to the story. They were story, they were putting men in jail for the cock fight. And all they talked about is how their egotistical minds were sticking out there, but all they can fight for was with their breasts. The cocks fight with their breasts. I mean it's crazy. I mean, it's like sexual talk. I mean, when would I come out here? I mean, I don't know how many people will be under 18, but let me tell you one thing. Look up right now online about the cock fight, okay? Oh, I had a few broken ribs because you were a pig. Because when I go for ribs, okay, and I know when I go for ribs and my ego's out there and you break a rib and you're a rooster when you go... Imagine going to one of these one of these barbecue places. Hey, I'm going to the barbecue house. Yeah, chicken and ribs. One with the ego, the other one the pig. That's why I see that roosters are together with the chickens because of our egos. And it's the pig about the ego of the two worlds, of the two, two choices that you have. You want to be good? You want to be good? You want to be mean? You want to have everything? You want just enough to survive to help others survive? Having nothing and wanting nothing and less, you can therefore help nobody, so you're just as bad as those who want it all. If you cannot help yourself survive, then how can you help others who cannot help themselves? Just to know the difference, you know it all. So remember, the next chicken that goes cock-a-doodle-doo, you know he's out for his own ego. That red head. They're out for their own egos. Putting into our own minds that saying, where is the red or where is the red planet? I'm going to end this video by just showing some numbers off. 5777, seven, seven, bring it to the seventh year. This says Egypt, E-G-Y-P-T, Egypt, right? Five and two come together, one, 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 six, six, six around the dice. That's where you get your Egypt with the T at the end. Here's your T over here. This is the B and this is also the T. This zero, zero, zero says Fox. This says creation of love joy. Five, seven, 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 and five, seven, seven, seven. Is one five 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 one five one life of Mars, five seven 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 is one oh one one oh one one oh one from eight four four four. Five one 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 and five two six six six. Fifty two is the number to Earth. Fifty two is to the heart. Twenty five is one quarter. This becomes Jupiter and Venus, and that's how our power stage is set up. Jupiter and Venus circulating through Mars and Saturn. Is it a sin? But every time they say size or sin or sick, depending if it's the first letter or the last letter, if they use the N as the first letter, they're using this symbol over here, the Z and the N. If they're using it as a small letter or the last letter, they might be using it as a capital letter because it is first and last makes it capitalized for three-letter words. Or if it's in the middle as sick, we can have these N as a C if it's in the middle of the word. Using that if there's an N in the middle of the word, it might just be a C. The sick and the sin, the ego chicken and the rooster.
the three bases on the diamond and understanding that the diamond, remember, we did not put a corner over here. If I would put a door in a corner, okay, you would cut off all the corners. They would be an octagon. But this is a square, and in a square, there's no door in the corner. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a corner. Otherwise, the door would be here or here. Otherwise, it would be a flat corner via, via flat corner over here. We no longer have four. We'd end up with more. So we enter over here, and we enter over here, and we enter over here, or we enter over here, or here's the ballroom. So we enter from these areas, and we live in these two areas. If I completed this, it becomes an X, or the train area. But we all know that when we walk into a room, usually we play from the concert from one corner of the room. What is the question? What are we looking for? Is there a situation that we must create this in order to understand if there's a bacteria that can really create itself by the form it takes? Because formality is everything. Raphael 7286 in a constellation of Pegasus. Thank you for watching.